good, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Dan Banks, a.k.a. DJ Fine, CEO of JTU. We are Jersey Magazine and Jersey Diamonds. I'm here with my boy, Peter Postway. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! We're shaking. You feel me? Bro, I finally figured no. out all that, man. <laughs> that joint is fire. My boy, Peter Postway from Jersey in the building. You already know you're about to shed some light on us. Make sure you go check out his project, Supply and a Demand. It is out on all platforms. Out Don't play with it. Make sure you go out check it out. It dropped. It's been out. Make sure you go check it out, man. It's fire. Catch bro. up. You already know. So my brother, people far away, appreciate you coming through, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate them. Of course, man. So talk to me for a little bit, man. Let's chop it up. So supply and the demand, okay. out all platforms. All platforms. Nine, nine tracks. You know nine slides. Now you dropped it in the summertime, right? So like July. Yeah, July. Right? I you dropped know? it on my son's birthday. You feel me? So, 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 we, so we don't forget nothing. No, of course. You know what I'm saying? So the world get a get a get a glimpse. Right. Like, that's 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 a real personal personal thing. Yeah, I like yeah, that how yeah, you dropped yeah, this. Yeah. It's real intimate kinda yeah. kinda give me um your fans a little bit of your world and yeah, everything. Yeah. But then like you said it's, it's memorable. Yeah, it's I memorable. Like, like he'll he'll be able to go back like bro. Definitely, definitely. Right. Now now earlier we was listening to some of the tracks, you know, we got everything on deck, you know what I'm saying? My word is gold, mm -hmm. nothing new. We got a lot of just a lot of fire. Uh, was it J Pot J J J Pat J Pay. We got a lot of fire stuff, man. You know, so you make sure you guys go check it out. Like I said, all streaming platforms. We checked it out on Spotify. Oh, don't forget Bustin' Wide too. Don't forget. And Bustin' Wide, everything on deck. We gonna get we gonna get <laughs> okay. don't give it too much, bro. <laughs> oh my bad. <laughs> you feel me? But like I said, like, we excited. That project is fire. I'm telling you, we was checking it out. It's dope. So now, talk to me about supply and the demand, right? So let's go with just the title first, right? Okay. Supply and the demand. Tell me about how you came up with that title. Uh, I, I figured like supply and demand was like more or less like giving what the game been missing. Like, like this is my my contribute contributions to what's going on. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? So like, like it's a demand here. So let me supply it like, real quick. Yeah. I like that. Now, how'd you go about um, actually figuring out what tracks you want to put on there? So, like, we were talking about it earlier, so everything on deck. You've had that in your archive yeah. for a little bit. So now, we always talk about, like, when um, a lot of artists, they have a lot of music from back then that they didn't drop yet. Yeah. So tell me about, like, some of the um, the formula you use for this project. Like, how'd you put it together? Well, me and my man, uh, Kamikaze, we sat down, like, and, like, he helped me structure it because, like, you know what I'm saying? I, got a, I still got a lot of songs that, didn't, that were supposed to go on the right. album. But then I'm like, okay, you know what? Like, I'm I'm a, I'm a rookie. I'm fresh in the game. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not about to give all my work away. Right, Plus, right, I don't right. write, so it takes me a lot to think of what's going right, on. Right, right. So I try to make concept songs. So everything that I did for supply and demand was like for my transition, like yeah. through from the streets to legal to owner yeah. and shit like that. Definitely. So, like, shout out my cousin Rel, and shout out Kami on the help me put in a whole trip. It's definitely, it's definitely dope when you always have like a story behind, you know, your projects and everything. So for you, what what, what do you feel resonated? Like what was one of the tracks that resonated with, with you the most that um, kind of put together or kind of like shed a little bit about your life, like on the track? Like what would you say was one of the main um, tracks that uh, you expressed yourself the most on? Uh, Brenda, uh, Bernard and Brenda's Brenda, story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I felt right, that. Right. That last track, I felt right, that, right. yeah. That, that, you feel me? Jay Pay. Those two. Okay. The beginning, J Pay was like me coming home. That was the rawest song I ever made. Like, it's like it was just like, no, like we ain't edit, we ain't do nothing. I, the way I, the way we laid it, yeah. the way I put it on it. I like that. You yeah. feel me? So like that was my most production, and then cause, and then I made like the transition to Brenda's. Like, and I'm like that. Like that's Tupac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my Tupac. That's my Brenda's got a baby. That's my contribution. Yeah, you feel me? That's fine. Now you also have a favorite track called "Everything on Deck." So tell me about like how you came up with that. We were talking about this man was on a plane and he was writing lyrics. Oh yeah, and like tell like me about now, like the, the um, I was down track. in Atlanta. It was me and my cousin Frank White or whatever. Yeah, you feel me? And we was like in the parking lot. We just had to get finished getting something to eat. So you know the hustles down there. They moved yeah, down. Yeah, so they course. like yo, I got this. Da, 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 da. So I'm like yo, you ain't got this. Like something pertaining to that, like man, you pull that shit out, like man, we got everything you need down here. Where you from? Yeah. Okay, link, you know what I'm saying? So it just stuck like everything you need. Getting on the plane, I started, and then I built like the hook around it. Once I built the hook, yeah. then I, I put one verse, and then like a month later, I put the other verse, and then it was like, all right. Through it in the archive. That's fine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Now, where do you find yourself most passionate with music? Like, what, when you're expressing yourself on the track and everything, laying it down and everything, like, what are some of the things that go on in your mind, like, behind the scenes? Because I think we don't talk enough about that. Like, when you're actually in the booth, 
you know, and it's a lot of pressure. Like, granted, you know, you could be vibing, you could be chilling, but like, you know, in your mind, you're like, yo, I, you know, you don't want to waste too much time yeah. overthinking something. So, what's some of the things that go on in your mind? Simplicity. Okay. Simplicity. Okay. Like, I mean, you know what I'm saying? You gotta listen. You gotta look at the whole mind of a person right now. The attention span not even that long. Like that. Yeah, so yeah. songs are not even. Like growing up, we was getting four minute songs, four, five, five minute songs, right. nigga, body. And right now, you get a song, a person to take off and become the next popping thing with a minute and twelve seconds. Right, right. You right. feel me? So it's like, all right, concept. Those are two things: simplicity and the concept. What yeah. are we talking about? What the beat made you feel like? Right. You know what I'm saying? Organically, it's like I said, I don't write, so everything I'm, I'm walking down on the beat. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? Like every. So once, once you get, so once you get in the studio, what's the hook? You just, you just the hook involved. of the vibe. Right. The hook of the vibe. Right. right. And that's actually really, really a really unique strategy as far as being an artist. Like mm -hmm. you know, saying like I don't, I don't sit there and I don't write like all day. I actually like just go straight up. Organic. Like feeling, organic, organic feeling, and not overthink because you know that that can stress you out. And you know, some people, are, some people are writers, so that's that's love, and, that, and that's no, a great no, thing. I'm not taking that's that for nobody. That, yeah. Right? I swear, but I, I don't know. Like in my English class when I was like college or whatever, yeah. he like he said that I write how I talk. Okay. Yeah. And it's a certain they a name for it, so that's why I just stopped writing. Right. Because it's like I'm going to put all these extra words in there, right. that don't and then it. when I go to try to recite it. It's not gonna come out the same right, way. Right, what right. I might as well just use right. all the words in there. But that's love because again, that's you and that's organic. Yeah, yeah. So then, like, so if I say, "Oh, I, uh, I know Pete, uh, Peter Parkway. Oh yeah, you feel me? Laid this track down. I know that it's real organic. Like you didn't have to sit there and like sit on it too long. You didn't have yeah. to write it all out. And, like you're reading like a whole paragraph. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was like, no, this is how I felt at that moment. This is how I felt. And this is, this is what I'm giving you. Take that off. Put this on. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, let me do this whole thing because I'm writing it. Yeah. I probably write the first. While we listening to the beat, once we get the hook or some type of concept, you know what I'm saying, together, whether it's me or where I'm doing a feature like for somebody and shit, you feel me, features is 500 to 250, I fuck with you. Let's yeah, go. Check them out, that. man. Check them out. I write all out. You yeah. feel me? Um, but like if we uh doing it like that, like like I'm trying to get the whole, I get my first four bars yeah. out. Once I get that out, it's on. It's over. That's not good. That's fine. Now, as far as visuals go and everything, right now, like, I know, I know, I know, I know. He coming out. He gonna come out with some stuff, man. <laughs> he but my boy, shout out my shooter though. He, he pulled up with the videographer, so you know he ready to shoot. He ready to shoot today. He was like, yo, after this, we gonna go shoot a video. <laughs> Word up. You know we I'm need saying? to Word up. <laughs> But now, but now, tell me about like the visual concept. Like, what are we looking at for supply and the demand? Like, I know you, you, you already bodied the whole album um, EP and how you gonna lay it down. So now, how you gonna do it as far as pushing the visuals? Uh, I wanna do. At? Uh, I wanna do back to backs. Okay. They, they, they might come back to back to back to back. To back. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm trying to gain some type of buzz. I'm keeping it a hundred. Like, yeah. I don't got no buzz. Like, but if you hear me. You gonna be like, oh shit, who the fuck yeah, check my boy out. Who the check fuck cars? Take my boy out, yeah. Like, for real, like, but like once I catch some more type of momentum, you know what I'm saying? Like, I guess with the visuals, that's the way the people saying that it gotta go. So that's the next step. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm new to this, so like I don't yeah, got yeah. no type of guidance. Nah, of course. Like, well, you here, and we are Jersey Magazine. You feel oh, me? Yeah, Jersey. So we here. So mm. check my boy out, Peter Parkway. Check my boy out. That's now. Cool. Now, it's not just music, my boy. He got the fashion line out, too. So, let's talk about that Saturday okay. Aura, boy. Uh, uh, I Garments. Got some, I, got some, you know I, got, I got some for you and D, too. You feel me? I might have to ship it to you or that. bring it Definitely. back up. Yeah, you feel me? I just need to know what size I got you, bro. But uh, Savvy Aura is a it's clothing awesome. line like I've been sitting on, dealing with for like, i say about two, three years. You know what I'm saying? Started off with sneakers. Like, yeah. I make it, I get I found like I'm up, you know, four, two, three, four, five in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Come across some type of distributor, manufacturer in Italy That's that makes sneakers. Okay, okay. So, like, so I hit them up. You know what I'm saying? They made me a pair of sneakers. The first ones I lost in Miami. Fuck around with broke <laughs> rich again. We done popped the trunk. Yeah. I done lost it, so I had to come back and make the name again. So when I came back to make the name again, that's when I got. The, the different spelling of it. Okay, okay. To make it, it was just regular S A V V Y. Right. You feel me? And just like ah, yeah, so I'm like S A V V I. Right. Ooh. 
change the you on the aura. Ooh, yeah, yeah, you know. So, so now what? Now what do those um, those two phrases mean? Because it's just two different words. So yeah. Now, tell me about words. tell me about the meaning behind like just the whole name in general. Okay, sa savvy savvy is to make the better decision like and that. some already good decisions. It's like having options. Right. Like to have oh sh like I can eat shrimp or I can eat lobster. Okay. What do okay. I want to eat right now? Right, right, right. Either way, I'm not going wrong. Uh -huh. It's just what do I want to do? Right. You feel me? And to be witty, you know what I'm saying? And then aura is your first impression of the person. I like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like what you leave when you come in the room. Like So when designing the clothes, like I wanted to think like, you throw my shit on. Like, God damn, like this, 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 this is, this, this right here is a feature. A garment on garments on and then garments on hangers is a boutique. Okay, okay. That I'm trying to set up to where like that. the other independent artists can run the funnel. So we run the plays like the Savior with the Chosen, or Savior with the Culture. I like that. Savior, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like for it's the, all love. Like, yeah. Like to where we running like plays Savior, Paul Lord. You know what I'm saying? These are all brands from my area that we could, you know what I'm saying? Mix it up to where. Take off, like you know. Mine, mine is one hand washes the other, man. That's for culture, it. definitely. And they wash the face. That's fire, bro. Most definitely. And actually, what made you get into the whole fashion line and everything? Because you know that's not an easy line to even jump into. But you, you got the the gear, you got the yeah. names, you got the hoodies, the sneakers, and everything. Like, how do you even how do you even get into something like that? Um. Well, like, like the motivation. I ain't even gonna lie. I can't commit. Like he's like, yo, you gotta hop into this. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I got an icy business. Okay. Like I first started off selling uh. Uh, slushies, like okay, okay. during the summer, like so. That's my main hustle. Like you feel me, like real trap. You will see Peter Parkway. Don't care what you think or say. <laughs> selling some ices. Selling ices. I got the, like <laughs> I got the adult ones or I got the kid ones. But before I had the adult ones, I only had kid ones. Like you feel me, like and that's like, the hustle. Yeah, and, that's and it's not. Like, we turned it into a business. It's me, my son, and my dad. That's fine. It's called Three Generations it's Family. I love that. I love that. Unification. You I like that. Yeah, yeah, of course, like. Like, I was like, that's what it is. So, but, but um, with Saviora, like, it's just like the symbol is a peacock. You know what I'm saying? It's said that the peacock will meet you at the gates of paradise. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? The like peacock that. means longevity, and prosperity. So when you when you thinking of a brand, you want to think of something that's gone. There's some meaning behind it. Uh, yeah, right. And then when they burn down on you and ask you like, yo, what's that? Oh, this da, 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 da. is that savvy? That's like Nike. Yeah. Just do it. That's it. They kept it simple. Just do it. We don't got no fucking mission statement. Yeah, right. <laughs> Just do it. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, so yeah. it's like savvy or why I be regulars? Right. I like that. I like that. Why I be regulars? I like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? So like when I when you think of a brand and you're trying to brand yourself, you gotta you gotta think like. So it started at the sneakers. No one barked the sneakers. Like a couple of my guys bought the sneakers, you feel me? So but no one, you know what I'm saying? But me, I don't know the marketing. That's where I lack it. Right. But I know how to get it out there and I know how to, I'm an innovator, so right. I'm gonna make it regardless. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? If I put it on the back burner or whatever, but I put the sneakers on the back burner and I started messing with the clothes. You know what I'm saying? Found a distributor. Clothes started taking off. Right. Find you a distributor, okay. find you it's a marketer, okay. find yeah. you a vector, yeah. same. Like, you need, holla at me. Holla at me. Check my boy holla out. Holla at me. Like, I've walked you through this everything. shit for a small fee. <laughs> Most of the fee is, I just want to be able to say, yo, we got money together, R T -M, I love it. related to money and mission. That's why, oh yeah, you feel me? Oh yeah, opportunity <laughs> you earn. I like that. <laughs> like I said, man, Peter Parkway is in the building. My brother, tell him how they can book you, follow you, and check out your clothes. You already know. Catch me on all social media. It's Peter Parkway. That's just as it's spelled. Peter, then Parkway, underscore, Oye, O-Y-E. Uh, you can catch the clothing at Savvy. That's S-A-V-V-I-A-V-R-A, -A -A, underscore, G-O-H. You feel me? That's on what's the name. Just hit me up. You know what I'm saying? Send a DM. Whatever. I do features, like I said, you know. We could work that out. We could swap it out. It don't even really matter. Like most definitely. Right? Yeah, there first and Peter Parkway. Make sure you go check out supply and the demand on all Schmidt Plaza. Jersey, my boys in the building. Central that we is. Jersey man. You already Shout know seven three two Hub City F Town. Oi. Jersey turned app entertainment. Entertainment.